Hi, I want to show you some quick and easy ways to delete blank rows in Excel. So we have some data here and it has blank rows and it has one, two, three, four, five blank rows. Now, of course, that's not a lot. So we can quickly go in and right click the blank row and delete it. However, imagine if it's more than five, maybe it's 500. So we want to find a quick and easy way to leverage the tools and that are already in Excel to help us clean the data. So first thing you want to do is make sure you're on the home tab, go over to find and select. But before we do that, we want to make sure that we have all our data highlighted and you can control a that, or you can just drag your cursor. So once you do find and select, you want to go to special. Then you want to go to blanks and you hit OK. And you can see that it highlighted all our blank rows. Now that we have that highlighted, we want to delete it. So in the same area under cells, you're going to go to delete and delete sheet rows. Boom, your data is all clean and there are no blank rows. Now there's another way to do this. Let's put the data back in the original format. Again, this data is broken up with the five different blank rows. So what you want to do is go and select it all again and click the data tab and click filter. Once the filter is there, you can click it and you can actually find all the blank rows. So let's just choose the blank rows. Once you have that, click OK. You can't see anything except the headings. No. If you look to the right, you can see that one, two, three, four, five, five rows that is a highlighted blue. And you can just click those five, right click, click delete row. It's going to say, do you want to delete the entire sheet row? Yes, you do. Delete it. Now you want to unfilter it by selecting all. Boom, your data is back in. in a very good clean format. Those are two quick ways to remove blanks, rows in Excel. Hope that helped. Thank you.